World class dive in Cuba? Yeah, right. Whoa, 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 what is this? Jardines de la Reina. In English, that would translate into Gardens of the Queen. I really don't have a clue if Cuba ever had a queen, but if it did, she would have been very proud of those gardens. Gardens full of life, healthy corals, colorful fishes and sharks. Lots of sharks, on all dives, everywhere, at all times. I didn't know before really that such a place existed here in the Caribbean. To be honest, I was um, a little hesitant at first when my friend Alex Say invited me to join him on this trip. I mean, of course, I've heard about this place before, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's a common, uh, well, it's one of the famous places, so to speak, in, uh, in the diver's world. But yeah, you know, it's in the Caribbean, I've done a couple of places and uh, I wasn't too blown away with my experiences so far. So, yeah, the main reason for me to come here was because I urgently needed vacation. And so I just said, okay, let's do it. And uh, yes, yes. This was some of the most enjoyable dives I've done anywhere, for sure. Got uh, very healthy corals, soft corals, hard corals, sponges. Uh, one thing to point out really uh, that amazed me were those groupers. You see them on, on uh, many, many dives. They're very, very friendly. They come right up to you. They are not afraid of divers. They literally bump us, uh, I would say. And those guys are quite big too, which probably means that the reef protection is working quite well. Just look at this guy here, for example. Came closer and closer and uh, finally I couldn't uh, resist anymore and uh, I did what I had to do. I, I gave it a kiss and yeah, for the love of the planet, for el planeta. In many Caribbean places you can probably dive for a month and you will never see a shark. Uh, so this is definitely very, very different here. They are literally everywhere. It's uh, silky sharks and Caribbean reef sharks. You have them on all dives and yeah, from the first minute you get in the water until you get out, they, these guys are around. Uh, that was a pretty, pretty cool thing to do, which well, I haven't, I haven't seen anywhere before in the Caribbean at least. So on this note, I want to just say, well, thank you Cuba and uh, all the people um, contributing to uh, the protection of the reef and the sharks in particular. I think you guys have done an outstanding job. I also remembered that I once was very much into free diving. Unfortunately, I haven't practiced that a lot recently, but here it was just, uh, I had to do it. It was so easy, so shallow, the reefs 5 to 10 meter where they start. So I switched my scuba gear for my snorkel and uh, yeah, well, as soon as I jumped and went down, I, I really lost uh, track of time and space. Must have been 20 Caribbean reef sharks around me. Uh, warm water, clear, only 5 to 10 meters deep. It could not have been better, seriously. This was heaven. I mean, I've never had an experience like this before and it was just it was just so cool to be able to do this. I mean, where else in the world is that even, even possible? Man, the best. And let me tell you, you don't have to be a freediving pro to do this. The conditions here are just so easy, so shallow, no current, as I've said. You jump with a snorkel and next thing you know you're surrounded by 20 pretty serious looking sharks. To all my friends I've met along the, the scuba road, you've got to do this, you've got to do this, you've got to do this. I've been told that uh, you even have the chance normally here to, to snorkel with the American crocodile in, in the mangroves. Uh, unfortunately we didn't get the chance to do this, so we didn't see it, but yeah. Just alone uh, thinking about uh, the possibility and uh, yeah, imagine just being in the water with a crocodile on top of all of this. This is just boom! 
So yeah, is there world class diving in Cuba? There is. It's called Jardines de la Reina, 2019 January. I was here, I saw it, and I really can't recommend this place high enough. If you are into lots of sharks, beautiful corals, um, tropical fishes, American crocodile apparently, then please do come. If you do not like any of those things, please do not come. And one more thing, the old cars here in Cuba are quite nice too, by the way. <laughs>